Our son is Jack and he's 23. Jack moved to Bright Futures on November the 7th this year, nearly one month ago from now. Is it a month? Gosh, yeah, yeah one month, month ago. Yeah. I felt like we had some support for the first time, yeah, somebody that understood time, for yeah. the first time. And I think also the staff were so caring. You know, just simple little things. Come in and sit down before you go and see Jack. Have a cup of tea, catch your breath. And just saying to us and reminding us that we had to have some time out. You know, just go home and just have a break for the night or the weekend because you need to rest and, and relax. And I think just having that understanding, people don't grasp how difficult it is unless you're in this world. Yeah. And not many people even know this world exists. So for somebody to actually take care of you was phenomenal. Would stay, he would wake up in the morning, go to the toilet, go back to bed all day, never leave his room. Um, they would almost try to force him to eat. They would have to hold him and he would eat at a million miles an hour with these immense levels of stress and self-injury. Now already he's, he's walking around the house, he's sitting out in the garden, he's eating on his own, unsupported. I mean, Nick went and he, he ate a meal and she just sat and watched him and had a cup of tea. I mean, these are incredibly small things, but they're unbelievable steps for us. Never ever give up. Absolutely. Never give up. It's a really sad state of affairs, but it's the parents that shout loudest that get the appropriate package for the child. And if somebody tells you that something's not available, don't believe it. You've always got to have in your head that it will happen and that you're going to do it. And no matter how hard it gets, you just have to remind yourself every single day that eventually you'll get there. Thursday they called us and said for the first time he'd smiled. I think he said like maybe two years since he smiled. Maybe more, more you would think.